Tammy, how are you? I'm doing really well. I'm so excited to be here, back in New York, where I'm from, premiering in New York with my movie. It's always good to be home. Uh, so this is the New York premiere or the premiere? This is the New York premiere of Limerence. Where has it, where has it been before? Uh, it's been in Los Angeles, where most of the movie takes place. And um, I'm originally a New Yorker who's moved to L.A. And uh, the main character in my movie is a New Yorker who's moved to L.A. So you can see where I got the idea. So this is your brainchild that came from you? It actually started as a play. I wrote a play uh, that we did in Los Angeles that was set in New York. And it was adapted to a film that's set in Los Angeles. So there you go. I really do both coasts. And did you find through the uh, theatrical, uh, doing the theatrical production of it, did you find that uh, where the kinks were and kind of how it would work as a film and what audience responded to and what they didn't respond to? Yes, so, some of the comedy certainly, like having a live audience really gives you that feedback. But um, my producing partner, Brad Zions, who produced Kissing Jessica Stein and Iron Abbey, he was in my audience on the second performance of my play and we met and it was his idea to adapt this into a movie and uh, that's how I ended up writing and directing and, be, and doing this whole thing. What is the movie about? You know, isn't that the eternal question? Oh, um, is it very complicated? It's not very, okay. well, yes, it is very complicated uh, because it's about love and love is very complicated. Yes. Romantic relationships are very complicated. Limerence, which is a word that I'm very excited to share with the world, is about, um, you know the honeymoon stage when you're obsessed with somebody and all you want them to do is text you back? It's been a while, but yes. Uh, where you're falling in love, you're infatuated with the person, and it's a real uh, time period. And my movie asks a lot of questions. It doesn't really answer them. It asks what happens uh, when that fades. Uh, we look at unrequited love, and it's also about art because the main character is a painter. And what happens during the creative process as you're falling in love or having turmoil in your relationship, which affects artists. What are you hoping to get out of the festival today? To help get the movie out there, to see what, uh, to see how audiences respond to it in different places um, is certainly exciting to me. Seeing it with audiences in different cities is so unique. You know, we made this movie and I didn't know who exactly was going to respond to it and who our audience was going to be, but even from the time of the play, we've had people in their 20s really respond to this movie and people who've been married for 50 years really respond to this movie. And that, to me, is... Wild, actually. Well, it's a universal theme, you yeah. know. Anyway, thank you so much, Love and uh, chat with you. good luck. Uh, good luck here at the festival. I thank hope you guys you. win lots of prizes and me so too. forth. All right, <laughs> Tammy Minoff with Limerence.